Seniors living in the Michigan Veteran Homes at Grand Ra in Grand Rapids are already preparing to cheer on Team USA. Yeah, News 8's Kyle Mitchell explains how they're getting into the Olympic spirit. The seniors are really getting into the Olympic spirit with a celebration and a friendly competition. With the countdown inching closer to the opening ceremony, the seniors living at the Veterans Home in Grand Rapids are feeling the excitement and anticipation. I like the sports, the challenge of it, especially with other countries. Donald Jane served in the Marine Corps in the Vietnam War and was one of the veterans enjoying the festivities. He's looking forward to watching many of the events. Mostly track. I like people that run fast, you know, and, and uh, do the relays and the hurdles or something else. I mean, <laughs> if people can run fast and do the hurdles, they're, they're a heck of an athlete. Get up, get up, get up. <laughs> The organizers adapted a variety of sports to be accessible to seniors. Their tribute to synchronized swimming involved wearing goggles and passing a sponge over their heads to see which team could fill up their water bucket first. They always look forward to any celebration that we have when we have music and fun games. It's always really fun for them. But I think it also just kind of connects us right now. Um, our country is having these big games and so it they can't be involved all the time in that kind of thing, so it kind of gets them involved in what's going on in the country. The Activity and Volunteer Services manager says they tried to make the experience something every resident could enjoy. So every July we celebrate uh, the opening of our new building. So this is our third year, so it's kind of a birthday celebration. We all got to move over, over to this nice new building. So this year, because of the summer, summer Olympics, we decided that we wanted to have that theme and kind of have a field day, music, fun. The veterans say they have an appreciation for the dedication of the athletes and their talent. I'm 92 years old, <laughs> so I've watched them quite a few times, you know. So uh, I know that them, I know that how they train, you know, because I still work out at 92. Above all, the Olympics bringing the country together is something Donald enjoys. You see it on every TV every day now, you know, and they're interviewing people and, and, they're, and they're just psyched up about it, you know, so there hasn't been a lot of that in the last couple of months. The opening ceremony is tomorrow afternoon right here on Wood TV. Coverage begins at noon. Reporting in Grand Rapids, Kyle Mitchell, News 8.